Okay, number 79, the half counts. I'm going to play it for you first, then we'll talk about it. One and two and three and four and one and two and three and four. One and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and. Okay, so now this one doesn't have a rhythm wrap with it, and we're going to find that happening more because they've kind of established a, a pattern, right, where you have a rhythm wrap and you have a song. So Basically, what I'm going to say for you to do is to make your own rhythm rap. Now, all you have to do to make a rhythm rap is just ignore the pitches and say the rhythm and shadow bow it. And then once you've got that down, then um, do it on an open pitch, like, like just a single note, either a D or an A or a G or, or whatever you, you want. All right, so let's do that right now. Let's look at the first two measures. All right, so you got quarter notes and half notes, just like in the other rhythm rap, right? Here goes. One and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and all right. And so then you want to practice that, make sure you can do that. And then what you would do is look at the notes that you have there. Oh, actually, I forgot. You should play it on an open string. My mistake. Ready? One and two and three and four. One and two and three. Okay, so just be sure you can say it and play it. That's really key. Okay, that makes the big difference. All right, so now the next step is going to be to, to name the pitches. If you don't know them, you know the drill. Turn off the video or pause the video and go back to page 14 and then come back. All right, so if you said D, D, C sharp, C sharp, B, A, you're correct. So what you're going to do is you're going to do your fingers. And actually, I'm going to hold my viola this way so that makes it easier for you to see. Okay, here. Ready? D, D, C sharp, C sharp, B, A. All right. So you want to do that. Then if you can do that, then say one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and. Okay. So you notice what we're doing is we're separating the jobs of the one hand and the other. And then we finally put them together. All right. So here we go. First two measures. One and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and. Okay? And then what you do is you do the same thing with the next two measures and you got it. All right? Have fun.